For the first time in almost 200 years, bison are now roaming through a nature conservancy in Newton County. News 18's Brad Oppenheim tells us about the bison and how they'll play a role here in Indiana. Spanning nearly 8,000 acres, the Kankakee Sands Project is nestled halfway between Lafayette and Chicago. Owned and operated by the Indiana Chapter of Nature Conservancy, the project started back in 1996. Since then, more than 6,700 acres of prairie has been planted, serving as home to native birds and wildflowers. A few days ago, a new animal was added into the mix. We made the decision to bring bison here uh, for prairie management specifically. Uh, it's just kind of that next step in the restoration uh, here in our, in our work. Uh, trying to recreate the prairie landscape in Newton County. After rounding up the bison from a nature conservancy in South Dakota, the bison were loaded on a cattle trailer and made the 15-hour trek to Indiana. They arrived in Newton County on October 15th and will live in a 365-acre parcel for now. Like Site them. manager Ted Anker says the prairie is open to the public and so far, the public has taken a major liking to the animals. We have a whole new clientele that are visiting uh, this project uh, because of the bison. And uh, as part of that, uh, we're hoping that uh, people can learn about conservation and grasslands in the state of Indiana. Shirley Alvarado and Al Matul made their way out to the prairie on Monday morning. It just makes me feel good that uh, we haven't destroyed uh, wildlife and, and the history of uh, Indiana. Anchor says through all of the hard work, the experience has been rewarding nonetheless. This project has, has, uh, has been one of the highlights of my career. It's, it's part of, uh, was my long-term goals uh, as, a, as a project manager uh, to, uh, to bring bison onto native prairie. He says down the road, the herd will grow to 50 to 75 animals. Reporting in Newton County, Brad Oppenheim, News 18. Oh, beautiful animals. The operation is being overseen by the Indiana Board of Animal Health and the Indianapolis Zoo. Anchor says the last time bison were free roaming in the state of Indiana was in 1830.